Welcome to my channel. Today I will be making some vermicelli. Okay, I have one can of evaporated milk, one can of sweet condensed milk, I have some raisin, I have spice star anna, and I got some clove, cherry, I have sugar, and this is the vermicelli, and so some butter. All these will be using into this menu today. Um, first, I'm gonna boil the spices so that they could get all of the niceness out of this spicy hair, right? I have the water here, and I'm gonna put the spices and let it boil. I want it to boil well. Then I'm gonna parch the vermicelli so stay tuned i don't think i mentioned the nutmeg okay and also some almond essence okay what i will be doing is melt while the spice will be boiling i will add the sugar so all can boil together and this is just half a cup of brown sugar and i will be listing all the ingredients in the description bar down below all right I'm gonna stir this up and let it melt. I don't want it to let it let stay one place. Now, if you want to use white sugar, your chance. Some people don't use no sugar; they just use the um, bamzel. I will be using a ten ounce, ten and a half ounce pack of bamzel. Now, you can use less. It depends on how much people you're gonna be making it for all right so i'm gonna add the butter into this um sandwich because i want to start parching the vermicelli all right in the meanwhile this is one one pot spoon or maybe one cup Right. See it boiling? I'm gonna add the bamzelli into the pot. And this bamzelli is using a very fine one. Alright. I get them brown. See? One more minute, and then I'm gonna add the um, the liquid so that this could boil. All right. I want to get a little bit more brown. Keep doing this just to um, don't burn, you know. Stay tuned. So, I'm gonna strain this um, and then I'm gonna stir it. You can smell the spices in this. So what I'm doing now, I'm gonna let this boil for two minutes or so. I'm gonna cover down and let it boil and then I'm gonna come back. Okay, stay tuned. See it? So look. Okay. I'm gonna add a little bit more water and let it boil a little bit more down. Because you want it to get soft before you could add the milk, all right? A little bit more water. So just add some more water. 
As you can see, so what I'm gonna do, cover this down and let it boil, all right? I'm gonna add the raisins, but to me, it doesn't make, well, if you add it later, essence, almond essence, and let it keep boiling, boiling. All right. If you add it later or, or not, it still have to go in. All right. I'm going to add the milk. And I'm telling you guys, if you don't like too much of sweet, half a cup is just enough when it comes to sweetness or less. Always remember, it depends on your taste and like that. We, you don't have to do what we are showing you. You can do for your taste. All right. One can of milk. And I'm gonna add some condensed milk. I'm not gonna use the whole can of condensed milk. All right. And I'm gonna use some nutmeg. Of, of course, I told you guys about the nutmeg. This is my take. Let it boil. So I just now add cherry and I'm gonna let this boil. Alright, let it boil down. I also add the half of can of the condensed milk or the sweet condensed milk. And this is to boil down now. And then it's done. Alright, so stay tuned for the finishing part. So this is it. When it's finished, I'm gonna add this to baking a dish and let it cool all right stay tuned so this is it when it's finished don't forget to subscribe like this video and give this video a thumbs up okay if you're not yet subscribed what are you waiting for subscribe all right when this color I'm gonna cut it and let you guys see what it look like and finish all right when when it get cold i'm sorry